Hello runners, so this is the first time I'm wearing a sports mask so you're looking at me by wearing this particular uh, stripe mask that I received from the UK from a company called Craft Cadence I saw my other videos where I do a test run using a cloth mask and a surgical mask so they asked me whether I would like to try out their brand new uh, N95 and PM2.5 sports mask so this is the first time I'm wearing a mask that's designed for sports come with complete uh, this particular filters and also exchangeable filters inside just walking in this mask I can feel it's much much more breathable than the other masks I want and it looks pretty cool as well today I shall wear this mask uh, for a 10k test run to see how it feels or how it compares against the cloth mask and the surgical mask and I will update you at the end of this video so let's go let's go let's go First gate down, still feeling pretty good. Uh, ran the first gate at 547 pace, pretty breathable so far. Let me take a short rest first before I come back to you, okay? Alright guys, I'm back! So, yeah, done. So as with every run in the mask, right, the thing I look forward to the most uh, is taking off the mask after my run uh, to finally being able to get uh, unrestricted fresh air. Okay, there I go. So, uh, whew, okay. <laughs> Ah, fresh air, fresh air, fresh air, fresh air. Of course, this is my third run with a mask on and this is the first time I am running with a sports mask. As as running with any mask, right, it elevates my heart rate, making breathing uh, much, much tougher. Okay, before I go more in depth with the review of the mask, let me try to squeeze uh, to see whether it trap any water. Unlike the cloth mask, which really trap a lot. Okay, that's quite pretty really awesome. Okay. So this particular stripe mask right, is advertised as a N95 and P2.5 mask which is suitable for cyclists, runners, joggers and other intensity sports. So for myself, right, I'm not able to judge whether it do its job well in the N95, I just have to assume it does. So this review is purely my own opinion on how comfortable it is to run in this particular mask. And this mask weighs just 20 gram with a replaceable filters like this. There is this three filters along together with the mask. Mentioned that the removable filters is able to last 90 to 300 hours depending on pollutant levels. Alright, after talking about what is being advertised now, I shall go more in depth about uh, how comfortable it is, how feasible it is to run in this particular sports mask. The thing is, it's definitely much much more comfortable to run in this as compared to the cloth mask. Does not really trap water which is awesome. Does not get much heavier as I continue to run and run. But I still remember the cloth mask, uh, it becomes so, so, so much water uh, with every breath right, I was actually sucking back my own saliva that time. Look at the amount of water. <sighs> yeah, that's how much. Sweat it is. So probably because of the other materials that it's made of. Initially, right, when I start wearing this mask, I was really afraid that these particular two things, because I've not wear worn a mask with plastic that's brushing against my mouth. So my concerns were really uh, unfounded. As I continue to run with it, in the first few kilometers, I get more and more comfortable. It's very comfortable to be able to breathe in the mouth, but not really in the nose. Yes. In terms of breathing in the nose, right, it's still pretty difficult but in terms of mouth because of this particular filter, uh, it's quite comfortable and quite easily breathable. When I was running first kilometer, no problem, second, third, fourth, fifth, 
all no problem until until it's um, five kilometers and above that's when the trouble starts uh. so the common problem with running in mass right the common problem is of course the mass will keep sliding down and this particular mass right first five kilometers i do not experience it after the fifth kilometer the problem starts of course it does not slide as much as the cloth mask but as compared to the surgical mask right, it tried to slide down more I end up having to keep readjusting my mask time and time again from the 6 all the way especially towards the end where the 8, 9 km, 10 km right, if I don't readjust my mask uh, every few hundred meters right, uh, the mask will completely expose my nose, nose leaving only my mouth covered so another problem that i face because this particular uh, filter is a replaceable filter i have the feeling that this filter start to become uh, unattached from the particular main uh, housing of the mask which makes it slightly uncomfortable i don't know whether other brands will be able to produce a mask that wouldn't slide down so if given a chance i would definitely love to try the other types of masks as well so that i'll be able to compare against one another good thing about this mask as compared to the cloth mask i do not feel numb at my mouth area i really still remember after removing my cloth mask, uh, it is all totally numb around my lips area but this mask, do, I do not have the same feeling so when I'm not running and wearing this mask for my daily activities when walking around right, this mask definitely feel much 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 more comfortable than the other cloth masks I had tried before I said at the end of the day, right, run anything below 5km I think it will still be quite suitable but anything above that, it will be really really difficult alright that's it, so my first ever run with a mask designed for sports completed! Uh, if you learn something Something from today's video remember to give me a thumbs up subscribe to this channel and ring the bell so that's all for this video remember to stay safe and keep on running